Hello, people of the internet. I'm Solrak Dragon, and welcome back to Dark Souls 2. Last we left off, we entered the Brum Tower, Berm Tower, whatever you want to call this tower. And yeah, it wasn't as fiery as I had expected it would be, given the location of the fountain thing that led us here. Anyways, we made our way through it down to here, so let's pass through this fog gate. Given that there was a bonfire back there, I doubt there might be. There's gonna be a boss behind here, but you never really know. Yes, through the fog. Okay, we are over here now. Where exactly here is? I think it's lower down on the whole rung. All right, I can deal with that. Let's roll into these bosses, just for the heck of it. There's a ladder there that we could take, or coal chute that does nothing for us an elevator that does nothing for us because it hasn't been activated clearly all right let's head down some more then this area is definitely a bit of a stranger one really oh that was a trap and a half trying to get me to fall down there huh huh game huh well, lucky me, I am more clever than you. I will not fall down to your trapping skills. Okay, try attacking. Attacking required head and weakness. Um, did I seriously break something that was obstructing the other side? I guess I did. Huh, that's interesting. So oh, this big guy is a bit of a berserker. He goes down pretty easily, it seems. Excellent. Uh, only thing here is a shoot downward, so no idea what the point of that was, except for get getting that enemy out of my hair a little bit early, probably. All right, let's go along to the other side and see what lies over here. Oh, we can't. We can't drop down. Nope not corpses along with some armor and such that makes me feel a little bit worried open this door and it leads us to a bunch of these barrel guys that really are not threatening because I don't have a fire weapon did I really get him to drop his barrel? cool Alright, uh, roll through here, get this gunpowder just in case I don't want it blown up on me later. Maybe this some unfortunate idiocy of mine. Alright, we got another one of those ashen things over there, as well as what looks to be a very big guy there. Uh, guessing that's the way we're supposed to go, however... We did have another ladder we could go down first, so we'll go down that other ladder first and then work our way back over here. Yeah, that makes logical sense, I think. Or anyway, it wasn't even a ladder, it was just a chute, which does lead me down there anyways. Okay. Uh, looks like we got a big guy, a couple barrels, a repair, and an ashen idol thing. Alright, this should be interesting, a fight. Huh, I gotta think this through. Logically. Alright, we're gonna want to have our soul arrow up, clearly. That could get us in some extra damage. Then... Come on, crystal soul mess. I was hoping it would do its magic and just fire off with me standing up there, but nope, doesn't look like it does that. Sad face. Um, that's not what I meant to press. And magic does not seem to do much anyway, so that's not good. Oh shoot, they have almost got me killed. Drink! Get out! Roll! Roll, man! Roll! Roll! Ow! Jeez! Ouchie wawas! Ow! Yeah, that was expected. Alright. Well, we know that he's the fire spitter now, so that's something. We got some more information for that death. Alright, getting our stuff back is gonna be a little bit tricky because we... No, I took out the one barrel dudes as much as I could. There is still 
one wandering around down there. And we know for a fact that there's three of these small knights along with the big fire spitting knights. So it's going to be a little bit tricky to deal with them all. But given the weakness of these knights, where we can usually two, maybe three shot them, if we kill one, run back, and then head down once they've lost aggro, I think we should be able to do it. Let me just check my equipment real quick. Third, Ring of Steel, Ring of Blades, Blends. Alright. Yeah, we still have that one of them wandering down there. I did do some damage to him, though, so... Ouch! Freaking... Ow! I guess we won't be getting that 100,000 souls because... Yeah, that makes no sense. He doesn't even have a head! Alright, it's managed to get me a couple of times to get to this point, but I have finally gotten it down to just the big guy and that one way over there. Needless to say, I have definitely lost out on my 100,000 or so souls. Run, 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 run! Oh. I just need to be careful with him because he is an annoyance and a half to fight. I want to get him underneath here so that I can possibly do the plunging attack on him. But, I don't think it'll be that easy, unfortunately. Now, we could possibly go over there and drop down on the archer. However, I feel like that idol is just waiting for me to get close to it before it'll do something. Anything, I don't know. So we're going to have to try and lure them both, or at least the big guy over here, without the archer. Yeah, I died a couple times. I died more than a few times. Flame quartz ring plus three, really? That I don't at this point. Whoa! Why are you not rolling, dude? I pressed... Ow! That burns! Okay, we need to climb. We need to climb because we need to heal. Okay. Get moving. Got to move it, move it. I, I need to move it, move it. I need to move it, move it. I need to move it! Okay. He's got quite a bit of health. Oh boy. Ouch. Ouch. Oh. Finished. Oh. Archer is all that's left now. Thank goodness. Kill the archer. Who now has a long sword. Don't believe how long that took to do. Are you kidding me? Oh, I thought it was something more things I was going to say. Uh, how many of those wedge things do I have left, actually? I have four. Alright, that should... Hopefully we can find more. Eventually. Ow! No. Examine. Use the smelter wedge. Drive it in! Ugh! Eat wedge of smelters. And I drink in victory. <sighs> that was more than a little tough. Let's use our last human effigy, yeah. I ended up dying so many times that my health got so low that I needed to use it, otherwise I would have kept dying and the cycle would have just repeated itself over and over and over. Alright, what do we have in, out here? Uh, so far, nothing from the looks. Lots of corpses, but it said tough enemy. Okay, another one of those spirit things. Or armor spirit thing. Whoa, 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 wait a second. You could not pull that kind of BS before, man. What was that? What was that BS? Dude, that was the major BS there. You deserve to die for doing whatever that was that you did. Because that was some major BS. Uh, human effigy, so we aren't out now. Uh, some large titanite shards, the dried root, and a twinkling titanite. Okay. Nothing too great, but nothing too bad. The human effigy really is appreciated. Be wary of magic and then pincer attack. Alright. Close range battle, ranged battle, pincer attack ahead. Alright, so I can see one enemy seems to be able to shoot 
spells. Why did that suddenly move? Um. Okay. The armor just suddenly faded. That was weird. Alright. I want to be at full health. Let's see. We're gonna... It's, some people might think it's a waste, but I'm using a radiant light gem there. Because I don't want to put any effort into my other things. Okay. And I'm guessing that armor is going to come alive shortly. Something. Ouch. Okay. Was that pincer attack thing just a lie to get me to try and focus on my back? No, it wasn't a lie. So, Axie. Hello, Axie. Goodbye, Axie. Hope you meet your friends and beyond. Oh, another one of you. Halbeardy! Again, hope you meet your friends in the beyond. So the pincer attack was not a lie. It was just very ineffective. Ow! Okay, I was not expecting that. Sniper spot. Whoa! What the heck was that? Um, let's get this flask drunk up. And then cautiously approach. Okay. Screw caution. We're gonna just... It's a mage one. And more than a little bit tougher than the rest. Okay. Still not too tough, thankfully. And sniper shot and short try left. Another human effigy. Nice. Very nice. Jeez. What is that that they're hitting that's causing such big booms? I uh, definitely don't want to fall. So we're going to want to climb slow and steady to win the race. Although, it looks like we could possibly drop down on that side. No, can't. I don't think. Can't edge along there. I doubt I could get there, but maybe hmm. running jump roll. Yeah, that might work. Here goes everything. Run jump roll for the win. Oh yeah. Not here. No hidden doors. No point in coming over here, other than the fact that we did it. Lovely. Uh. Oh man, I forgot. I don't have any soul spears left. A soul vortex? How will that do against these guys? I think not well. I imagine it's just spinny spin. Yeah, that didn't do too fantastic. Still, all right. We know we have three to deal with: archer, axe, sword, and then there's also a spell. So we have four to deal with. Possibly some possessed armor as well, or whatever you want to call that suit of armor that comes alive like a ghost. I like to call it possessed armor because that's what it pretty much looks like. Come on, Axie. And roll! And he still hits me. No surprise there, but okay. Drink on up. Glug, glug, glug. And now comes the fun part. Look. Whoa! Where did you come from? I was not expecting to be snuck up from behind. He almost got me there. Good thing I heard, see, saw that message say, look carefully. Otherwise, I would have got got. Alright, we want to draw some aggro. Good, we got axes. Let's pull Axie over here. Come on, Axie. There we go. Good, Axie. Come on. Be a good Axie. There we go. Good Axie. Who's a good Axie? Who wants to die? Ow. Ow. That's not a good Axie. That's a very bad Axie. Bad Axie. Bad. Now you're making you make me use a dragon charm because you're such a bad Axie. Alright. Dragon charm used. Let's take out Swordy. Ow. Really? There we go. Sorties down. Whoa, lag. Really lag. Now is so not the time to be lagging on me. Let's retreat into here so we can heal. Alright. Peek. Looks like magic is not the last one. 
Axie sneak attack. The Axie sneak attack nearly got me there. Probably gonna be some more sneak attacks waiting for me as well. Okay, lag. Really not the time. Lag. So not the time. Whoa. I'm lucky I survived there because she it just disappeared and yeah. Okay. Uh, what do we got here? Soul of a great hero here. What's here? I doubt there's anything. And you know what? I feel like this is not snow, actually. I think it's actually ash. Which means we're not on a cold, snow-covered mountain. We're on a hot, ash-covered volcano castle mountain thing. Which is actually kind of dangerous when I really think about it. So I guess this is not a cold yet hot place. This is a hot yet ashy place. Uh, we got the fog gate there, but we're going to ignore that for now and instead head downwards. See if we can't find another bonfire anywhere. Without lag being the death of me, because it probably will, knowing my luck. Nothing over here. Did have an item over this way. Hug the wall to make sure there's no hiddens. Alright, what item we got here? A raw stone, nothing too fantastic. Um, hmm. I feel like I might want to go over... Really, lag, stop it! I feel like I might want to go over here before I head through the fog gate. Though it might be deceiving me by wanting me to come over here, I think this is the way I want to go. Down? No, I don't think I want to go down. Going down would probably be... Are you kidding me? Where's the spirit? Where? We need to get off this chain now. Try left, phantom. Where's this phantom? Where are you, phantom? There you are, hiding. Okay. This lag is gonna get me killed if this phantom's competent in any way, shape, or form, and that is very ominous looking. Alright, um, let's have Hoven Crystal Soul Mass up, because that could end up saving my life. Okay, Mal Maldron the Assassin is the name of this person. Ouchies. Wait, where are you running, Maldron? Trying to lure me into some traps down there, Maldrin? Huh? Well, guess what? You're not gonna trick me. I'm not falling for your trappy trap ways. Okay, this is not a mimic. Keep our eye behind us. To make sure we don't get backstab ganked. Some bonfire aesthetics, an item we very rarely use. Oh, let's use a radiant life gem here. Alright, we got those guys throwing at us. Uh, hmm. If we get close enough... Whoa, it got real... Whoa, 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 whoa! Curse? That whole area is curse-filled. Uh-huh. Well, that's certainly up to the danger factor more than a little bit. right what the frick okay you know what this area is gonna have to wait this is de definitely danger zone area um let's head back this way i guess maybe we can draw that phantom back to following us that that area is curse area that's dangerously dangerous i mean really dangerous i didn't i honestly unless there is like one of those curse pot things, I don't think we'll be able to go down there for a while. I wanted to read the message, not pass through the gate. Oh no, oh no, it's gonna be bad. Okay, it's not bad. Good. Uh, huh. Bigger opened area. Not seeing any enemies. That gives me reason to worry. More deeper down we could go, potentially. Uh, door ahead. 
very much doubt that. Impossible. Rear ahead. Um. Hmm. Interestingly interesting. There's some significance with this chamber, I just don't know what. Spell quartz ring, plus three. Oh, a bonfire. Good. Um, try rolling or slashing. There's a door here. Curse. It's locked. Okay, I thought it was gonna, like, curse me or something like that. Which I would have called Major P.S. on. And that's where we came in from. So, first things first, let's head up this bonfire over here. I thought I saw a phantom, too. Yeah, there is. And there's more. Hmm. Let's light the fire, and let's take a rest at it. Cannot- Oh, darn it! Forgot, I'm being invaded currently, so I can't use bonfires. Darn. It hurts me, or it really hurts. Um, magic stone. This is not really that phantom invading me. I can't do anything. I can't rest at the bonfire. I can't risk progressing any deeper into this area because, I mean, who knows what's around here? I don't have many, um, many, can't think of the word. Now let's examine this. No scorching iron scepter in the inventory. So a scorching iron scepter will activate this whole mechanism. That's good to know. <sighs> I mean, Darn, this is tough. I'm gonna take a moment to think this through, so I'll be back. Okay, in the end I decided, rather than progress linearly, we're gonna progress down here, because we need that phantom dead before we can do anything. And honestly, if we die, then we die, is what I, all I can really say. Um, let's see if we can't... Bungie attack. Why do these guys have AR? Okay. Kill it, and we're gonna be cursed here shortly. Okay. And the curse is just gonna keep renewing. That's not good. Roll, run, jump, roll. Alright. Silver talisman. Ow! That hurted. Drink the flask up. And now we're gonna be hurting soon. Ow! Really, I can't even see you when you're about to shoot. Ow! Oh! Get back. We need to get back real quick. We need to draw him out of here. Because constantly being cursed is not helping our situation right now. And into the light of day, you shall be defeated, Dragon Charm. Okay, that should give us enough heal power to get over the... Actually, did that cure one of our levels of curse, possibly? It looks like it might have. Why is his weapon... Are you kidding me? He's coming back alive! What is this? It's one of- there's one of those ashen things here. There's got to be. It's got- it's the only logical explanation for why I'm continuously being cursed. And why those things can come back. Oh, hello. Goodbye! Um... I don't see any of them around here, though, so that's what's really confusing me. Okay. This is gonna be tricky. Okay, thankfully, dying there put me at the bonfire that was down here. So that made getting back over here much easier. And we know where Maldoran is hiding now. So we can't let them get away this time. We need to pull as many backstabs as we possibly can to get them low. And we cannot let them run away this time. Okay, roll... Backstab, good. Because if they get away again, then they're gonna lock me into this area once more. Backstab, come on, get them dead, get them dead! 
Oh, only one more hit, maybe. Good. Invader has been banished. Excellent. Dark Spirit, Maldrin the Assassin, has been vanquished. And what do we get for the reward? A human effigy. Good. Now comes the tricky part. We need to make our way through here. We're just gonna have to run, to be honest. We need to find the, um thing responsible for all this cursiness. It's... Are you kidding me? The heck? Um... This is not good. This is very, very bad. I have no idea. There! There we are. Alright. Eat a smelter's wedge, you wench. Die! Still not stopping. Okay, it is stopping the curse build up. Good. Drink a flask. And get these guys done. They're much weaker now, actually. Alright, and they're not respawning anymore. Good. And everything's brightened up considerably as well. Ow! We need to get into some cover so we can heal. But we are undead again, which sucks. I hate being undead. I mean, it, it makes my mug look very ugly. And I hate having an ugly mug. Alright, kill this one, because he did his stupid trying to pile drive us maneuver. But, and let's start from the top and work our way. Okay, lag, now is not the time. But as I was saying, let's start at the top and work our way down with killing. Um, yeah, there's no hidden rooms here. Good. Just wanted to make sure. <laughs> Alright, then. You. You're the only one. Where'd, where'd your buddy go to? Aw, oh, did your buddy abandon you or so? Oh, come on. You're kidding me! Really? Darn it! Alright, then. Back over here. I'm, strangely enough, not seeing the guys. I mean, the armor's there, but... Okay, I guess he's... Okay, come on, really now. Lag is so not the time. It is so not the time, lag. It is so not the time when I'm being chased by friggin' possessed armor on a very precarious ledgy area. No, bad. Okay, I'm stopping the recording until this thing's dead. Okay, lag, are you gonna behave now? Are you not gonna lag like a good program. You're going to be a good program and not lag on me, please. Jumping. Uh, there is only one there, so, I mean, I really don't see the harm in it. Plunge! And just attack for once for the kill. Oh, come on! You're back again, lag! I thought we had an agreement. You weren't going to come back. This sucks! I cannot record with such heavy amounts of lag. Okay. I'm gonna clear this area out and come back to you when I get any loot. Alright, made it to the bottom. The second I approached this chest, actually, a trio of enemies did end up popping up behind me, so... Yeah, be wary of that in case you do come down here yourself. It is an ambush, it is a trap. Oh, come on, lag. Okay, we got this item here that was in an ash pile. It's two pale stones, so nothing too fancy schmancy. And in this chest, which I pray is not a mimic, good, it's not, we have a majestic greatsword. I doubt we're going to use it, so let's just look at it in our inventory. Oh, where was it? There it is. An ancient great sword of unknown origin. This sword was passed down through the generations until it reached Gordrin, wandering knight of Rosa, and <clears throat> and was lost upon his death. Uncannily, every last one of the prominent swordsmen who inherited this weapon was left-handed. So I'm guessing that means that it's a left-hand weapon, or at least that's where it should go. I don't really know. But, now that this area, this small pit of cursy death is done, we can head on to the next area, or rather, we will in the next episode, because from what I saw, I am getting a little bit up there on time, not to mention this lag has to take some time to resolve itself, because it is being a jerk face. 
So, we will come back next time, and we will continue in the Brum Tower of Flame, or whatever you want to call this place. I like Brum Tower of Flame because, I mean, it's kind of like the Hyde one, but more ashy and dangerous because of it. But anyways, that's all for next time. So, if you enjoyed this video, leave me some feedback in the form of a like or a comment. If you want to check out some more videos from me, then be sure to subscribe to my channel. And outside of all of that, I will see you all next time. Have a great day, everybody.